Boy Tech here and today I'm going to show you how to get rid of error 3194 well that error I, I finally fixed that error and I am uh, my iPod touch is open and is now running iOS 6.0.1 let me just show you right now um, settings and then general and then about and as you can see right here it says 6.0.1 all right so uh and it is working and so yeah so i'm going to show you how to get rid of that error it is really hard to get rid of it and i've tried lots of methods i've just messed up with my host file uh and everything but i finally found the way to fix it it is actually a very very simple way so uh, first of all <coughs> uh let me just tell you why that error came to me. Well, my iPod Touch was running iOS 4.2.1, and it was jailbroken. It was on a tether jailbreak. It was tether jailbroken, and uh, so first of all, I put it into DFU mode, and I put it into iTunes, and when I just clicked on Shift Store, and I picked my, friend, uh, I all got that error uh, that said iPod Touch could iPod Touch iPod Touch could not be restored. Uh, then it says error 3194 something like that and so I finally uh, did it and then now it's working really well uh, so uh, let me show you how I fixed it hello YouTube I have finally got rid of error 3194 and now I'm gonna show you how to get rid of that error 3194 as you can see I have got rid of that error and my iPod touch is working now and it is running iOS 6.0.1 as you can see right now uh and yeah the passcode is 2013 so uh yeah <coughs> and uh, i mean just so yeah uh and uh as you can see right here it says ios 6.0.1 um uh, and uh <coughs> so let me show you how i got rid of that error it is uh very simple i kept on messing with that host file but i finally knew how to fix it so first of all go to computer and then local disk C, and then Windows, and then uh, go to System 32, and then look for a folder called Drivers. It's right here. And then uh, go to ETC, and then you're going to find your host file. Double click it, and then click on Notepad, and then you're just going to find a bunch of stuff. First of all, you want to copy that stuff. Just copy, copy it all. Right click, copy. You have to make sure it's copied. And I'll just backspace, close out of there, and click on save. And now your host file should be empty. But don't worry, everything is copied, so yeah. Uh, <clears throat> after that, you don't have anything in your host files. What you need to do is, oh yeah, you have to do the, this with iTunes closed. Um, after you've deleted everything in your host file, what you're going to need to do is... Uh, update your itunes itunes is updated it, this is uh itunes 11 or 10 i'm not sure actually but this is the updated version of itunes and also after that you just plug in your your ipod touch you put it into dfu mode uh if you don't know how to put it into dfu mode then just search on youtube how to put your iphone ipod touch your ipad into dfu mode and <clears throat> after you put it into df and you have this uh uh uh, update what you're gonna need to do is not shift restore because shift restore gets the error uh, you're you're just gonna click on restore and then uh, click on restore and update and after you've done restore and update you're, you're gonna go to the verifying thing you're gonna by bypass that and and your iPod touch should or iPad or iPhone should have worked now and it should be uh working and running iOS 6.0.1 or later versions so yeah and uh, after that after uh, clicking update and update, uh, restore and update it should have done everything's okay and in the end don't forget to go back to computer and then local disk C and then after you've restored your iPod touch your iPhone or anything and after you finished all that you just unplug it from the from the uh, from the computer and just charge it normally and then 
you can just go to Windows again, and then System 32, and then uh, go to uh, Drivers, uh, ETC, and then go to your empty host file, and paste everything back, and then just file save, that's it. And that is how I got rid of error 3194. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. Please comment, like, subscribe. And uh, if you need any help, just comment below or send me a message. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. Goodbye. Hope I helped you.